guys I'm here with my empties video um, I got some really I got I got like one really nasty thing in here that is so offensive to me <laughs> I don't know what happened to it anyway let me go ahead and just show you everything that I have um, the first thing is like I love this I got this through um, um, Purex Insiders I did a giveaway with it um, I actually purchased this one my other one I got tossed out by accident before I got to talk about it but I did purchase this one this is the new dial miracle oil with marula oil oh my god it smells so good and it feels so good on the skin this is like the best I usually don't like dial body washes however I have a ton of them because of couponing um, but this one I will always repurchase this one it smells so good and it feels so good on the skin so this is a win 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 next this one um, this is my last one so I might as well throw this in this video too this is um, the skinny sticks this is a weight loss energy focus and fat burning from Xantrex um, I got this through Thomason and I would say it came I got three different flavors I got the purple one which was ber berry infusion which was my favorite and then they had tangy tangerine which was an orange one and that one was really good too and then they have this one it was like electric lime or something like that and this is my least favorite flavor this is actually my last last one of the bunch so I have to go and purchase more they do have them at Walgreens which I plan on going back over to Walgreens and seeing if they have it um, the one that's close by my house because the one close to my job had it but it had it in the bottle with um, like 24 sticks in it and I didn't want to get another bottle since I already have one but um, it's like it was like $32 for like 24 sticks and a bottle um, I just wanted the sticks only um, I think it works really well I gave a couple to my co-workers and they said that it curbed their appetite as well um, you're supposed to take it three times a day you can take it throughout the day or you can take it like 15 minutes before a meal um, to help curb your appetite but I do notice that when I do drink this um, first thing in the morning like not that I have a burst of energy because that's not the case um, it's more like um, I have energy that lasts until like lunchtime because usually by lunchtime I'm already sitting at my desk and I'm just like oh, I just can't wait to go home and I'm already moping about being at work so and I notice when I have this I'm more focused and I can get through like I do a lot of paperwork at work um, just auditing charts and things like that a lot of paperwork tedious stuff and I notice when I do drink this I can just get through it and just focus and be like oh it's lunchtime already so um, so for that I think it's it works and I can say that it does curb my appetite I did pick up running um, recently over the past two weeks so I've been running and then I take this with me um, as my third dose because you could take up to three a day um, my third dose I take it with me when I go running so I'll drink it before I start running and then I'll drink it while you know in between to take a break and drink something so I'll have this on hand and um, it's been doing really well I lost a couple of pounds I'm not gonna say how much but initially when I first first started using it I lost a couple pounds and then it was that time of the month and then everything happened and then I gained those couple pounds back so start up again um, but I, I would definitely suggest you try it out and see because it tastes really good and normally these kind of things they taste horrible and this one is really really yummy and like I said two of my co-workers went and purchased it on their own because it worked so well for them next I have from Clairol this is the natural instincts crema caratina um, I had two boxes of this I got this sent to me via Expo TV to go ahead and try out um, it, it's okay I like the color this is what I have on my hair right now this is the color of my hair right now this is chocolate brown um, it doesn't burn it doesn't it was easy to use whatever I mean it's a good product the only thing is that my grays are very stubborn and this has been about a week that I've had my hair colored and my gray hair is already starting to come back which you probably won't be able to see it but I guarantee you that it is coming back I just realized this is not a permanent hair color this is it says it washed away and it washes away in 28 days no wonder hello this is not permanent okay so for that it's really good then I changed my mind because since it's not permanent hair color it's expected to wash out um, however it's been about a week and it's already washing out pretty pretty decently um, so if you wanted to try out a color then I would recommend this to go ahead and try it out it, it did cover up my grays 
but again my grays are coming back but it's not permanent so surprise in it um, this one here I got from the pinch me box this is the Shea Moisture 10 in 1 Renewal System. This is the shampoo and this is the hair mask. I really, really like that. This shampoo is almost like a conditioning shampoo. It does say renewal, so I expect it to be really amazing, and it really was. Um, I saw this in CVS. It's like 10 something for the shampoo. It's a decent sized bottle, um, but it is excellent, as well as the conditioning um, hair mask really really good and I don't normally say that about shampoos in general I don't find that many that are spectacular but this was really 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 nice a conditioning shampoo excellent um, next is simple um, oil balancing cleansing wipes I always have um, facial wipes in an empties video this is like one of my go-to's I still have a whole bunch of these from couponing like last year so I haven't really had the need to purchase any wipes recently. I still have a bunch of different brands, including this one. Um, but this is a really nice one. I tend to try to reach for the simple brand before I pick out any other brands. So. This one, however, you can see it's quite full. Um, it was so freaking offensive, I can't even use it. I, I didn't even want to use it on my hands to take off makeup swatches or nothing. It's that offensive, the odor. This is the waterproof makeup remover. I don't know if it has a scent. Doesn't look like it has a scent, but it is horrific, horrific. I'm gonna do it for you, and I, I'm not exaggerating. I'm really not exaggerating. You're gonna say, oh, come on, Annette. I'm not exaggerating. I don't know if it went rancid or what happened because the wipes itself, I'm afraid to even put it to my face. The wipes look okay. If you look at it, they look fine. I don't even want to touch them because I don't even want it on my fingers. Oh, it's on my fingers. It's like oozing out of the package. Okay, I'm gonna go for it. Oh, it's just got this odor that just, it's like pungent. Like it smacks you in the face when you smell it. So I don't know if you guys have this particular one, La Fresh, um, what is it called? Waterproof makeup remover. You guys let me know. Is it just as offensive to you or did mine go rancid? What the heck happened? I have no idea. But this is, I almost want to do it again to see if it punches me in my face again. Let me try it again, just for the sake of, because I'm throwing it away. I'm afraid. <laughs> it, my stomach is nauseated. Uh, it, you know, Oh my god. I almost wanted to gag. That's how bad it my eyes are watering. That's how nasty it smells. Let's move on to something more pleasant. <sighs> okay, we'll, we, we'll replace the odor with something that smells amazing. This is a Dolce from Dolce & Gabbana. I got this through Buzz Agent. They have um they had like a I forgot what you call it some perfume and cologne samples that they sent to you to try out and it was a bunch of them mostly men stupid um and only two women sent so this is one of them and i really really love this oh my god it's so feminine and sweet and just so elegant and the bottle is stunning i think i might want to get this one i just bought a perfume and i if i would have thought about it i would have got this one instead i got a michael kors one and it's really nice too, but this one is even better. I'm going to put this in my eBay box. Let me keep this to the side so I can get it. But this smells so beautiful and just it's just lovely. Next is from Alme. Finally, I emptied one of these out. I got a whole bunch of these in a swap with Laura Sparkles. Um, and she sent me these and I sent her the purple version of them because I didn't like the purple one and she didn't like the blue one, so we swapped. Um, she had a lot more of these than I did of the purple ones though. Um, and I really like this. This is, um, the purple ones don't have like an oily, slick feel to it. These do, however. And to me, these take off all my mascara, my eyeliner and everything and just a couple little tiny swipes and I don't have to rub, I don't have to do anything. These are my favorite, all time favorite. I will always get this as long as they sell it. It's fantastic. I love it. And I'm, I'm really glad that I finally went through one but sad that I finally went through one. 
Next is St. Eyes Fresh Skin Apricot Scrub. This one I got in a box. I don't know which box. I also got one in Freebie Ninja's swap box, which I'm really happy about because I'm empty with this one. I, I want to say it was like a Target box or Walmart box in the day or one of those boxes. Heck, it could have been an Ipsy or Birch box. Who knows? It's, it came in a box though. Um, I really liked it. It has a really nice scent to it and the granules that are in there are just right. They're not too, too harsh like in a... Um, uh, microdermabrasion but they're not too soft where you don't feel them it's just right and I think these this is really really great um, once I'm out of these I have tons of face scrubs but if I had to go to the store and I didn't have a face scrub I would definitely buy this one but um, I'm not gonna purchase any right now because I have tons of them of different varieties next is just a toothpaste this is the crest optic white I don't know if this stuff actually whitens your teeth my teeth white they're I don't think that they're that white but um, I use this one it I just get them through couponing and I have tons of crest and whitening toothpaste and all that stuff and uh, this is just one I have another one on my counter now this one Visanti brighten up enzymatic face rejuvenator this is also a scrub that I used up this one is a little bit different than the st. Ives one this one is more um, has a more gritty sandy texture to it versus um, larger granules that the other one has and this one you can feel it scrubbing a lot more um, and it's a, like I said it's a little bit more finer um, I really like this I would consider purchasing the full size via Birchbox shop I think I got this through Birchbox um, it's really really good um, the full size is quite pricey so I definitely wouldn't pay out of pocket but I might buy it through Birchbox shop this one here, I didn't even finish it. It's all gr gross and cruddy. I've had it in my shower forever trying to use it up and I just gave up on it. I just couldn't use it anymore. I didn't like the scent. It's one of those things that is very, like um, like it doesn't have a lot of product. It, it almost smells like um, peroxide, almost. That's what it reminds me of and I just don't like it. Um, every time I use it and I clean my face with it, I have to use something else to clean my face again to get the smell off of my face. So I, I just decided I'm not going to use it anymore. Um, again, I have, you know, that much left, but it's just not worth it to me because I have to clean my face twice with this. Once to use this and once to clean this off of my face. So, um, and then I have these little tiny thingies. These had little, um, like acne, little spot thingies or whatever you want to call them. I forget what you call them. Um, gosh, I can't remember the name of it now. Completely blank. I got it through Thomason to do a review on. It's spot something. Gosh, I can't remember. Anyway, they look like little circular band-aid kind of things and you put them on zits and stuff like that to get rid of them. Um, they worked okay for me, um, but they worked even better for my son. I guess like the teenage acne thing. He used it overnight and then the next day we put another one on and then midday he took it off because we were going swimming and it was completely gone and it was a nasty one on his on his nose. It was like right there on the tip of his nose and it completely took it all away. It was awesome. Really, really good. So for that, good one. So that is my empties for you. I hope you guys uh, liked the little mini reviews that I have for you. I really like empties videos because you know exactly what someone thinks about the item that they're talking about. That's it you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again in another video.